So you just got your MacBook Air M2 and maybe have another M1 or an older Mac and you want to transfer all data including apps, games, photos, videos, music, settings and even wallpaper from there to your new device. Well, stay with us so we can show you how to do that. Now, first of all, it's recommended that before this procedure, both the devices should be upgraded to their own latest Mac OS, at least 10.2 or later. Now, if you're using Wi-Fi for that process, make sure both the devices are near and connected to the same network. Also, keep them plugged in or in charge, because this process will take a while. Now, if you've skipped the transfer process during setup, don't worry. You can do this after the setup process as well, like we're going to do right now. So this is my old device, MacBook M1, and here is my new one, MacBook M2. I'm transferring all the data from my MacBook M1 to M2. So let's get going. On my new MacBook, I'm going to Finder from there to Applications. Just go ahead and look for Migration Assistant. I hope you have found it on your own device as well. When you find it, double click on it, press continue, put down your device passcode and then press OK. Now here from these options, make sure from a Mac is selected. After that, press continue. On your other MacBook, go to Finder from Applications and the same way, search for Migration Assistant. And on your other device, select the option to another Mac and then press continue. Now when your device has found that other device, just tap on it and then press continue. And after that, make sure both the devices are showing the same code. Now on your older device, press continue. The device that migrating their data to another one. Now after that, you can select which information you wanna transfer from your other device to your new one. You can select or unselect the ones you don't want in here. And after you've decided which information you want, just press continue. And after that, when prompted, make sure you write down or take a peek of this temporary password. You're gonna need it later. When you're done, press continue. Now after that, in here, put down the lock screen password you have. Now for those who are setting up their device for the first time, set up your new password here. And then press continue to start the transfer process. As you can see in here, the transfer is in process from MacBook M1 to M2. If you use a Thunderbolt or Type-C cable for the transfer process along with your Wi-Fi, then the migration assistant will cycle between the fastest connection and it will accelerate the transfer process. Now, depending on the size of the data you're transferring, it might take a while. You'll just have to wait patiently. Now, when you see migration complete at both the devices, that means your work is done here. Now, after that, just wait for a while till your Mac takes a restart. Now, after restart, as you can see in here, the same account is transferred to our Mac. The account password that was set by the system we have shown you earlier in this video. And then set a new password and then verify it. And next, all you have to do is just go ahead, customize this account according to your own choice and preference. When you enter the account, hopefully you'll find all the data you've selected to migrate from your old device. You'll find everything on your new MacBook. So that's how you can transfer all data from your old MacBook to your MacBook Air M2. Let us know in the comments if you faced any problem during the process. We'll try to help you. Thank you for watching.